three-dimensional data comes in many different shapes. In this case, I have received an AutoCAD file with contour lines. It could also have been an AutoCAD file containing points, lines, or even a detailed survey from a land surveyor. So this is just one example. But the thing you have to do, no matter what kind of data that you receive, is to check and see if you have any levels that are not right. In this case, I will zoom and list one of my level lines and see that it's level 40. So my terrain or my levels in this area is around 40. Now to see if there are any wrong levels, I will flip my drawing and have a look at it from the side by choosing view, 3D views, and then just choose to left or right. And if I zoom a bit out, I can see that I have something down here. If I try and lift it, I can see that the C value is completely wrong. So there's, there's a mistake or there's an error uh, attached to this specific data. This is not good when I am to construct my terrain model, so I will just delete this part erase and see that I have now only this broad band of contour lines around level 40 approximately and I have now removed the wrong or the bad levels from this drawing and I'm ready to use it in my terrain model. Be sure to switch back to top view before you continue. Now this has been validated, I will save it as being my three-dimensional basic data ready for use in the ter terrain model. So save as. I will not be, be needing this as an XREF, I will be needing it in the NovaPoint folder and just directly under Tmod, basic data. So I'll know this is the file to open when I need to create my digital terrain model. The next thing is then to combine the different uh, basic data to get started on my horizontal design.